Hey guys, Sam here with Traffic is King. Um, just have a little something I wanted to share with you guys. I wanted to talk about optimizing your images for Google Image Search. Now, here you're looking at a website uh, that I built maybe seven months ago. Uh, it's a, a site uh, uh, tailored to people with iPods. Now, this site I haven't touched in six months. Um, I did a little bit of paper click but I've done no link building I've actually just sat this on the shelf and it has been collecting dust but you know what I noticed something I noticed that I've been getting traffic and this site is actually wired into an eBay affiliate program and I've been getting some eBay sales some uh, some co affili uh, co affiliate commissions and I'm wondering I'm like where's this traffic coming from so I dug a little bit deep I went into my analytics and I found, I said, wait a minute, I'm getting a search from, I'm getting traffic from the images. And if you can see right here, I'm getting 30% of my visitors are from Google image search. And it made me think, I said, well, how many of you guys are optimizing your images for search? Uh, this is a tactic that uh, is, is overlooked and no one actually does it. If you notice, most people don't really optimize their Im their images. They keep the, the those weird numbers and and uh, and what have you, and they don't really optimize it so that they can get uh, uh, traffic uh, that way. So, if you look at my server here, my server files over here, over here my FTP server. See what I've done. I optimize all my images for uh, for search. Here I have 3G iPod Nano Classic. Apple iPod Nano Red, Apple iPod Touch with earphones. Uh, these images here are part of my CSS uh, cascading style sheet, so um, that is fine. I don't have to do anything to that. Um, but you see, I optimized even more. I have I iPhone accessories, uh, iPod accessories, iPod Classic headphone. Now these are all search keyword search terms that people uh, are looking up because with iPods, you know, they want to see what they look like. So when I go to Google Image, let's just see where my uh, my uh, my pictures come up in the Google uh, Google Image search. So we'll put in Apple iPod Touch with earphones and just see where where I fall into this. And looky here, iPodGoodies.net. That's my site. So let's click on here, click on the image, and wow, look at that! It takes you to my site. All right, now. You guys need to utilize this in your websites and your blogs. Optimize your images for those keywords that are that are specific to your niche, so that you can get just a little bit more traffic juice uh, coming to your site. All right, that's all I have for now. I want to thank you guys for watching this video. I'll be speaking to you soon.